ladies and gentlemen welcome once again i hope you're doing great today we're going to be taking a look at the nvidia filters that i personally use to make msfs look amazing and honestly close to uh, fs 2024 so without further ado let's dive right into those settings now i apologize in advance for my nvidia filters to be in portuguese but i'll translate as we go okay so we gotta press alt f3 to bring up the menu and i only use two filters that's all without any filters it looks like this very bright very uh warm colors i don't particularly enjoy it too much so i decided to add a color filter and a um, exposure and contrast filter as well so if we go to the color filter these are the ones i use so zero zero basically minus 14 on the temperature so colder temperature make it look a bit more uh, bluish and then saturation as well on minus 12. on the exposure and contrast we go for minus 2 on the exposure 34 on the contrast highlights to minus 74 shadows to 8 and gamma to minus 12. now i'm going to show you how it looks in different times of the day and different places as well so this is without the filter. And this is with the filter. Let's also take a look at the cockpit without the filter. And with the filter. Now my favorite part about the filter is actually the sunrise and the sunsets. This is without the filter. And now with the filter. Just generally the colors here on the sunrise are just a lot better. They even look like 2024 to be honest. Now let's take a look at different weather settings. We have a cinematic weather setting from uh, sim effects try the cold setting looks okay not too bad high clouds rain and storm and now we'll do it with the filter as well cinematic with the filter cold with the filter really see the difference here high clouds looks on point rain finally storm now all you gotta do is just take a look at the nighttime so the nights without the filter always felt like too bright for me um Especially over towns, you get, you get all those uh, light emissions from the buildings and the street lights and everything. But with the filter, everything is just a lot darker. You can only see the, the spots. It looks really on point, but honestly, close to the ground, it's really, really, really dark. Let's see over here. As you can see, we'll do side by side. So this is with the filter at ground level at night. And this is without the filter so you can definitely see more without the filter but i i enjoyed the um the darker nights with the filter so let me know in the comment section below if you agree with these settings if you have tried them out and you enjoy them if you use different settings that actually look better than this let me know and also re remember that these settings are very dependent on the monitor you have okay they might look great on my computer but you might need to adjust them slightly very very slightly on your end to uh, get the best result but the baseline should be this one color and uh, saturation should be more or less what it is uh, on my settings but you might need to fiddle around with yours a bit to get the best result so if you enjoy this type of content don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel thank you all for watching until the next one safe flights to everyone see ya